Hi, my name is Beth Hiley here for Board Game Geek at Spiel 2016. I'm sitting down with Bilaje Kiblaski of NSK, NSKN Games. Always a pleasure <laughs> to be here. Again, oh, back again. It's like Team Bilaje and Beth. And you brought us What's Up? What's Up? What's Up is a very small game. It's a very fast, nice, a bit memory based, but also a bit of strategy here. And what you see here is the whole game. What you do during the game, you simply set up those cards, mostly like this. You can shuffle them up a little bit because you can see there are only threes, but let's let's maybe flip some of them. And <laughs> you just put them, you put normally all of them. I'm gonna so just well, put just a few of them here. Out there. Right, now, the game is extremely no. simple. What you want, sorry, yes. <laughs> so what you want is, you want to get a number of sets of birds. Now a set of birds is a one, a two, and a three in the same color. That's very simple. Now depending on the number of players, you either need two, three, or four of those. If you're playing with two players, you need four of those. And what you do on your turn is extremely simple. You just point to the card and flip it over. And if it's something you can take, you take it. What can you take? Well, let's say this, let's cheat a little bit. Let's say it's like this. So I have no red birds, so I say, okay, let's flip this. Oh, it's a one, so now I can Perfect. take it. Now, the red ones, I can only take two. Let's see, maybe there is a two here. Well, no, it isn't. So, now it's somebody else's turn. This is basically everything you need to know about the game, or maybe apart from one thing. The cards are constructed in a very specific way. If, for example, we have two uh, purple birds here, on the other side, we will either get one or three purple, ah, or two in another color. color. So you always have the same color or the same number on the other side. So there is a bit of strategy, like maybe, do I really want to flip this uh, red one because the guy on the left doesn't have red at all? So maybe if I do this, oh, well, I was lucky. But maybe if I did this, oh, again, I would be lucky. <laughs> Still, if I flipped a one, now the person so now if I'm just trying, so I'll say I'm going to see if I flip this three and Boom, indeed I'd be able to take the purple bird. Exactly. And that, that is the whole game. It's very simple. Like I said, it's a bit of a twist on classic memory. But right, because you might remember from having watched this flipped over before that this was indeed exactly. a red on the other side. Well, yes, <laughs> for example, I know this is a three red and I have one, so okay, I will try to remember that this is a three red, and when I find a two red, oh no, not nah. yet, but when I, found, <laughs> when I find a two red, maybe I will flip this back and take the three red for me. So, like I said, there is a bit of strategy to the game, but mostly it's light, it's fast, it's fun, um, you can play it in about ten minutes. And what triggers the end of the game? Uh, well, actually, when someone gets the last card, that's it. Easy Very luck. simple. And I'm guessing uh, collecting the most cards is going to get you the win? Well, uh, collecting a number of sets gets you the win. So, for example, if there were two players, we would have to collect three or four sets, depending on how long we want to play. So, the moment you have the last card, that's it, game over. You won. <laughs> And that is What's Up, which that is what's up. if you guys want to check out What's Up, that's from NSK, NSKN Games. Well, actually, actually, this ah, is from Strawberry, Strawberry Studios. Studio. <laughs> so, yes, we are related to NSKN and Strawberry Studios, but Strawberry Studios is for lighter games, smaller games, faster, more family-oriented. All right, well, that is everything you need to know about What's Up. If you'd like to go, check it out. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh -huh.